hello welcome back so what do we have in this video we have a laptop <coughs> model number is asus a541u so what's wrong with this one The customer bring this laptop for fixing. The problem with this one is uh, that it's starting and it's working very, very hard. It's very uh, slow. So uh, I've discussed with the customer. I make my um, I've make my um, proportion for uh, what should I do with this one but the owner asked me to reinstall Windows a new Windows a new operating system in this one so uh, first of all what I will do on this one I will make sure the hard drive is in perfect shape is working nice so for this uh, type of procedure I have to install a program to see how it works. Now you will see how difficult this one is working. Let me plug the charger. Look how difficult this laptop starts. So let's wait until this laptop is on. literally took like about 10 minutes for this one to start so this one it, I will think the problem with this one is bad software the owner told me he had a couple of things installed install in this one I have no idea what but uh, I'm not trying to make a maintenance for this one uh, I will only install the windows but first of all like I said I will check the hard drive to see if everything it's uh, in good condition and uh, I'm talking about pads they are probably on the hard drive and the Wi-Fi uh, adapter is not working so has more than one difficulty on this one so let's see what going on with this one I will not make a long video I will make a short one I will not take step by step step the inst installing uh, procedure but I will show you what I will do when I will 
when I want to install a new operating system on a device. Look how long it takes to start to load load only the windows. Look at this. Edges. It will take ages. But let's wait. Okay, so the laptop is on. Let me put the code. Even the even the when I I'm trying to put the code it it will take a couple of minutes. So we have a name here, so let me Okay, so this is how the laptop looks. This one is a nice one is an i3 7 gen uh, 920mx graphic card by nvidia by geforce so this is a nice one i enjoy uh, fixing those types of laptops but like i said when you are trying to install devices or program that you have no idea uh, things can be uh, can become complicated so probably next time try to not uh, install thing that you have no idea how to do it or probably how it works okay I will use a hard disk detector to inspect the hard drive to see in what condition this one is for uh, the installation so if I um, Okay, so if I see uh, a difficulty in the hard drive working, I will not install the Windows because uh, I do not want to make a bad impression. Let's wait until the program. I will put the laptop like this. For you to see what I'm doing. Okay, so the software is installed, installed. Let's wait the program to open. So let me show you so if you see on this side the laptop is 100% health and performance so the hard drive is impeccable so I will install with no problem the windows, the new one Let me shut down this
things because they are pop up all the times everything is a mess here okay so many programs that are working in background and in background and um, uh, it makes the the thing more complicated uh, for this uh, laptop so uh, on this one I have two drives I have local disk C and local disk D I will not interfere with local disk D this one it will remain in the same uh, structure I will only delete and delete uh, the local DC I will put a new Windows and uh, I will uh, uh, make a better life for this one so for this one because this one has no um, uh, optical drive I will use an external one for the installation I will connect it this device has two USB drive one is 3.0 and one is 2.0 or I think that's one 2.0 I will connect the external drive the Samsung external DVD drive to the uh, USB 2.0 because uh, the other one 3.0 is using uh, a driver to work if we need to if we need that uh, USB to work we have to install a proper driver to make it work so I will connect my external drive so the driver it's installed it's right over here this one is unit DVD ROM E I will put a new windows okay so I will restart let me take out uh, I do not want to do that let me restart the laptop and go to boot menu to change the boot order and after that I will uh, proceed with the installation type and I will stop the video I said I make this video short because I want to I want you to see how I'm doing when I install a new when I install a new Windows I would like to see if the hard drive is in better condition uh, the memory RAM I I check the memory RAM to see if everything is okay I first uh, what I'm doing I'm checking if the hard drive has no bad inside no physical bads or no logical bads okay so let me change the boot order boot menu
So this is how the Windows it will start at the beginning. Let's wait a couple of seconds until the Windows it will start. So from this point, I will uh, uh, keep uh, doing the installation uh, procedure step by step, installing the language, installing the, the um, partition, uh, detecting the partition where I want to install the new operating system, and uh, I will format the partition, I will make a new one, uh, and I will put the new windows. And uh, after I finish the installing, I will install all the drivers. I will make sure all the things inside are properly installed. And um, that's it. That's it. I hope you will enjoy the video. Uh, if you have any question, leave it down below. I will answer when uh, I can. So uh, thank you for watching. Like and subscribe. And uh, we will see in the next video, because I hope today I will make another video, probably. I will um, see in what condition I will uh, uh, find myself to make the vid a new video. But if I'm, uh, if I'm uh, relaxed and uh, uh, good, say so uh, i will make a new video with uh, the new repairing that i will do today so thank you for watching and we will see in the next video bye <clears throat> so uh, I've decided to open this laptop because I installed the windows inside and uh, I installed all the drivers but the problem with this one uh, I cannot find the Wi-Fi card the Wi-Fi internet uh, by Wi-Fi connection is uh, not there i cannot find the wi-fi uh, card connecting stuff how should i say it so i've decided to open to see if in this 
laptop we have a Wi-Fi adapter let me find a plastic tool to open this laptop let's see what's gonna come first the back or the front So I think the front it will be okay. So I will unplug the keyboard and the touchpad connector. Okay. So we do have a Wi Fi connector, but Hmm. This one is a Wi Fi adapter or only a Bluetooth. Because I have no idea why. This device has no Wi-Fi. So let me clean the let me clean the connector for this. adapter and see if it will works and if will not work I think I will change the adapter the Wi-Fi adapter with this one so I will change the original one. This one has Bluetooth integrated or probably the main board has the Bluetooth chip on uh, on the, the the board or probably the device has Bluetooth inside. So I will clean with alcohol this Wi-Fi card. I will put and put it back. I will plug the cable. Put back the screw. And I will start the laptop. Look at this battery. Look at this battery. So, <laughs> this one, if something is getting trouble with this battery, you only have to take the cell out one by one and replace it with a new ones. So, that's a good thing. But look how awkward it looks. Okay, let me change. Look, I, I have one right over here. This one is a, a little bit bigger, or no, it's the same size. So, if one of the cell is dying, you have to replace it with this one. Okay, that's nice. Let's plug back the keyboard because the power button it's. It's on the keyboard, 
So let's plug the power button. Along with the keyboard. And start the laptop. So the laptop is on. Let's wait. <coughs> like I said in, in the previous video, <coughs> I've installed the new Windows. Everything runs smooth. And um, after I installed all the drivers, I've discovered the Wi-Fi card has been not detected I cannot find any graph any Wi-Fi card so let's see what's wrong with this one so you can see the laptop it's a bit faster than the first time But I didn't expect it. A laptop with a 7 gen processor working so so hard. It's so intense the procedure with this one. I have no idea what's the problem, but I will figure it out what seems to be the problem with this one. So yes, we do have the Wi-Fi connection. So yes, we do have the Wi-Fi connection. I will show you in a couple of minutes. Look, we do have the Wi-Fi connection. So the problem, the problem with this one um, was the, has a bit of corrosion on the on the card, on the Wi-Fi card. So, problem solved. I will stop the video and I will post it with the other one. Okay, bye.